Hello, my dear friends. You're here for Bitcoin, right? Then let's get into it straight away. My interaction with Bitcoin started in 2018, end of 2018. To be very specific, the cost of one Bitcoin was almost $3,100 only. And today it's standing at its peak, almost $59,000. But it's always saying two sides of a coin. One can be good, one can be bad. So many people earned millions of dollars in this Bitcoin, but many of them lost millions of dollars as well. I earned good amount of money in Bitcoin and I lost good, good amount of money in Bitcoin as well. And how we will lose or how we will gain? Let me explain you my first hand experience. First of all, let me make you all aware about the companies which they run in the name of MLM, the pyramid schemes. Those are the frauds. The first one was USI Tech. It was based in Dubai, their head office, but it was an American company. We all invested in that. Hundreds of thousands of rupees. But, and within a year, they just shed their office like that and they vanished. All the big names, nowhere them. We cannot find them. How it happened? It all started with one of my friends who happened to be investing in this Bitcoin from a couple of months. One American guy introduced him to this MLM company, USI Tech. I also got impressed with the scheme, with the benefits what they were showing. Then I invested in that. Then I brought in more members. I made 23 members down the line. And I was sitting on the top. When they shut, down, shut it down their office like that, I was the one who these 23 members, everyone started questioning me. But I was not the one who did anything wrong. I was also the victim, same as them. Because my upline board, I had four or five uplines. But we all lost the money. And those guys sitting somewhere else, they earned millions of dollars doing nothing. For example, I'm, in, I'm investing in Bitcoin, $100. I'm paying $100 to a trading company. They are earning this out of this $100, they are earning some amount of money as a trading. That money they earned already. And the $100 what I paid when I bought some number of some amount of Bitcoin, what am I going to do with that? I sit and wait for that to grow. I keep on checking my phone. The graph is going up and down, all those spikes, up downs. To be specific in India, in those days, Zappay and Wazirex, two companies were very famous. Once the government of India authorities announced that they are not going to regularize any cryptocurrencies, these companies, what they did, they just closed down the Deposit and withdrawal of rupees, INR. For example, last few days, I am just I am I am not investing anything in the Bitcoin right now, but I am just observing it how it's going. Coin Switch Kuber, that's a very new app. I just downloaded it and registered my KYC just to look, have a look how the things are now, because it, after 2019 that. Instead, what happened with me, after that I stopped completely, I stopped investing in Bitcoin, I stopped uh, monitoring any of the cryptocurrencies, but now I have started monitoring only, not investing anything. The very first week when I made my account in CoinSwitch, Kuber, whatever it is, I saw a message there. It said, deposit of INR stopped due to technical error or 
the issues with the banks these all are kind of tricks they play my dear friends because the same thing used to happen back in 2018 2019 because of this we have lost hundreds of thousands of rupees and i i literally struggled two to three months with this zeppay company to get my money back and when i called one of my friend and i asked him which app do you use he mentioned other name and i asked him how is doing he said i'm not able to deposit inr or withdraw inr why is that so i said that is the trick they play they are not allow you to withdraw inr then what is the use of bitcoin what is sitting there in my wallet it's just a program it is not physical money you're not going to invest it anywhere as of now there are there's no companies no any organizations are accepting this i am not elon musk or i am not jeff bezos i am a simple common man where am where am i going to invest i am not so much rich that i am going to buy anything from tesla then where my money is going these guys sitting out there with their wallets they are just earning rupees dollars pounds you name any fiat currency they are earning them they are not earning bitcoin they are not selling bitcoin they are earning dollars ultimately we are losing dollars think over this my dear friends when you are not able to withdraw when you are not able to deposit inr what you are going to do with your bitcoin and you all must have experienced the same situation every time and in your cryptocurrency wallet i am not saying don't invest i am not saying invest i am just giving you my experience and making you the awareness about this all cryptocurrency that's it i hope you all understand what concept these companies are running and how they are making money if if you want to know in a simple way how they earn money watch that movie hollywood movie very famous movie wolf of wall street watch it with your friends only don't watch it with your family it's not for the family it's not a family movie so watch it understand the same way these guys with the cryptocurrency wallets are earning and we are losing i lost be aware about this i am saying no companies which i mentioned the names i am not endorsing them i am not against them i am just telling you my experience with all the companies whatever i have been come across throughout my cryptocurrency journey from 2018 to 2021 you all be aware this is the pandemic time people are out of jobs out of businesses there is no money for food for millions of people in the world they cannot even have one day meal there is no money with them and even in this time if you are investing in something which you are not going to use it you are not going to use it you are not able to use it anywhere that's a thing you need to think once again and that's it my dear friends thank you so much for watching my video please like comment subscribe my channel and stay safe stay home bye bye